than ever because in in the 818 there were so many Mario's because of Zenia. Of course, the character's busted. Like there was so everybody and their mother made the Mario, and then like in Ultimate, Nico came out and he just started consistently beating Zenyu, and then every Mario like just started disappearing. Yeah, <laughs> that's a hard match. I mean, you still got like three of them. Yeah, there's three. No, well, there's there's Zenyu. Master doesn't really come to lo our locals, but we have Noteka. Yeah, Noteka. That's the one I was thinking of. Oh, that's not a good sign. Oh, starting, oh, with the lag or the FP? Yeah. The loading, the loading. I think the FP pick was not a good sign. <laughs> yeah, just, like, the game, like, didn't even start yet, and it was already lagging. What about Jason? Jason doesn't play Mario anymore, does he? Definitely oh, no, he does. Mario he used to play Cloud. He's, that's right. He's in, that's right. He's in the Long Beach area. <laughs> I'm talking about my area. Mario's. That's all you gotta do. Lots of Mario's. I feel like there's Mario's everywhere, though. My region had like, way too many. He's good. He's not we had two Sonics though. and so many Mario's. Oh yeah, that's another thing that people miss about Lucas Street 4. Is that like down throw up there? Oh, what's going on, bro? Oh, what is going on? What is happening? Let's see. This match probably is going to be a little bit more strenuous on the internet because. Tony's a tank is from East Coast, I believe, right? I don't know where Iowa? OGP is from either, so... I don't know where either of these people are. Iowa... And let's find out. I don't remember looking at WebJP. Oh, New Jersey. New Jersey, okay. I was like, Rutgers? I've never heard of Rutgers. Can you tell me the state, though? <laughs> yeah, he's thinking. Thank you, Jared, man. He's so used to from New Jersey. Well, at least the connection cleared up right now. A little bit. Yeah, I think you just need a little bit of time to adjust. You guys are lucky, man. I've, I've dealt yeah. with some people where they see the connection load for one time, and they're like, Yo, lag test! And I'll be like, ah. Oh. <laughs> Even for a second, they stop playing and be like, lag test. People want that free W. No one wants to work for it to win. <laughs> you guys do not deal with it. I think I told you guys off stream, but like... I did a lag test for somebody who won, and then he, and then after I did a lag test, he's like, "Yeah, I'm just gonna not gonna count my W. You can give my W to the other guy." I was like, "Do you mean to tell me you won a lag test after the fact that your opponent won?" And the fact that the opponent gave the other player the win made me more upset. I wasted 20 minutes of my life. <laughs> uh, that doesn't surprise me. Yo. I'm talking to you, man. Free wins. Free W's. If I can get a free W, I'll take a free W. You handing out W's, Vance? I guess I am now. <laughs> Shoot. Some people get so mad the minute I tell them, like, I don't want to do a lot. Because I'm like, why? He's just like, come on, man. They don't really <laughs> There's no exist. fun. You don't want to do it? Uh, yeah, he's like, you don't want to waste 20 minutes? Come on, man. I was like, dude, they don't really exist. They don't do anything. <laughs> <laughs> Except tell me your opponent has money for Wi-Fi or he doesn't. That's all it does. Wow. For the first time ever I've seen Lucas use PK Thunder and not make it back to the stage. There are very few spots where that occurs. Clip by spin dash to forward air. Tony's aggression really it's like overcoming the play style that we have from WebJP, but WebJP able to clean up another stock. Wow, that's crazy. WebJP is crazy. <laughs> yeah, he's very. I mean, that was pretty good for him to come back because he got a lot of momentum from that, but now Tony's going to slowly take over. That was just good bait from WebJP. Kind of put Tony in a position where he thought he was going to be able to spike him, but then WebJP just kind of reset and then kept going. And then yeah. tacked on a few up airs after. But Tony's a tank, got WebJP at kill percent. Just needs to be able to land it. Wow. Gets getting pushed around again with the spin dash. It's 
Spindash is looking like he's having trouble connecting correctly. Nice, gets the Zara. A little bit of a cross up there, finally able to get something good. Down smash, Tony a little bit on the tough time, nice. That parry allowed him to pretty much get out of the corner. Ooh, oh, didn't hit with the peak fire. Uh, I, feel, I think he went a little bit too early for PK Thunder, and if he went just a little bit later, he probably would have got Kleptoni at the bottom of the stage. Yeah, Especially very high percent. game one. Next hit's probably going to win. Oh, that was clean. All the way across the sky. Tony brought it back with a, one of the Sonic classics. A beat up air. All right, Chris underscore SB. Let me let you know on a little secret here, man. I'm going to tell you something you've never heard before. Lag tests are not real. They don't exist. There is no effective way of determining lag. What will essentially what we do or what I do is a speed test, which tells me who has the faster internet speed, which allows me to determine who's probably the cause of lag. If I have 400 megabits per second and you have 31 megabits per second, that means you are the slowest player and I am the fastest. And DQing somebody because they don't have enough money to pay for higher internet speed is a sad thing to do. <laughs> it's the world we live in. It's the world we live in, dude. There is no such thing as a lag test. Absolutely no way. If I have a LAN cable and a faster internet speed and you have a LAN cable and you have slower speed, nine times out of ten, it'll be the person with the slowest speed, even if they have a LAN adapter. The, the LAN adapter only does so much, but also people who are playing this game online need to accept. If you're choosing to play on a tournament online, you have to accept the fact that the netcode is really bad. And that's what causes a lot of the latency issues. But too many people want that lag test, and I'm here to tell you it's all placebo. All it is is a speed test. And it doesn't, if you don't have a LAN adapter, I'm sorry, but you're making it worse. Is that what, is that what we're doing now, Warchief? What's going on? Why did, uh, probably why did the AP leave? I think it's probably just to see something. Sometimes, sometimes it's failure to connect in the, in the lobby. Yeah, but too many people get upset, like, as a moderator, like, too many people have gotten upset at me when I tell them, like, you have the slower speed, you might have to DQ and be like, what? That's not fair. And I'm like, what do you want me to do? <laughs> let you borrow internet speed? Three, two, one, what a world you live in. Yo, you just hand out internet like that? Let me get something. <laughs> right? <laughs> I'm over here. I mean, I have the speed, I'm not lying, but... But the difference well, it like it cleared up, so that yeah. The difference between more. Japan and the U.S. is Japan's towers and internet is more integrated than the U.S. Like for an example, they have Wi-Fi everywhere. Me, I have to walk at least ten minutes to the next place that has Wi-Fi, which is the Starbucks. <laughs> yeah, Japan is a smaller country, but also their towers are everywhere. They're way more everywhere than us. The infrastructure is designed to be like the way to have Wi-Fi everywhere. And I mean free Wi-Fi, not just like me trying to borrow my neighbor's Wi-Fi. WebJP able to land a nice sweet spot fair. Puts Tony off stage. Spin dashes to forward airs. Every time I see it, it's like never really sure what the position is because the camera like zooms in super far or super close. Like, ooh, is this gonna kill? Is this gonna do it? Oh, snipe! Yeah, at that point it was too much percent, which didn't allow it to hit. Oh, uh, nice. He, he wanted that chase so he could get the jab, and that would have been a pretty good... It wouldn't have killed, but it would have been a good percent. Yeah, would have. Look at that. Another... Oh, okay. But JP tried to style a little bit. Gonna lose his stock for it. He wanted that spike to put yeah, he did. Tony he did. in even a worse position. 
some spots for him to be in here, honestly. And Tony's putting a lot of pressure on to WebJP's shield, but fortunately he's not doing a lot of damage to it. So there's like little chance that he's going to be able to poke through it. Oh. Again, we see Spin Dash is not connecting the way Tony wants it to. Constantly seeing like Lucas just get hit by the front part and then just getting pushed back instead of getting um, sent into hit stun and knocked up into the air. It's, it's, it's just like um, how Tony mentioned earlier, it's possible that Lucas is actually falling off the spin dash. Very much how we saw his matchup going against Game and Watch. And even right there, we saw. Web JP get pushed off stage, and even though he was already in the air, he still didn't get knocked up. That's crazy. Nice. Comes back on the stage with the spin down with the uh, homing attack. Oh no! Yeah, another snipe for Web JP. Yeah, that's what he needs. He needs he needs those opportunities every time Tony's trying to come back on the stage. I feel like that's how he's gonna get most of the stocks. Yeah, it makes sense. Retreating to the other side of the stage, Tony getting hit with PK Fire and following up with an F tilt. Ooh! Nice sweet spark. Trying to cover the ledge with the down smash. Fortunately for WebJP, he's just a little too slow. Trying to go too fast, get, make it back to the ledge. Forward throw. I don't. Yeah, that was a good. That was a good opportunity. He didn't. Any throw would have looked at that point in the court center stage. Good read on the cross up there. Wow. Nice punish too. Dash attack is that powerful, huh? Oh yeah, I've I've seen a kill. Some, some pretty crazy defense. Yeah, JP looking really strong here in game two. It's possibly another PK fire away from closing out the game. He hops from Tony to tank though. Like, yeah. Making it difficult to tell when he's like actually trying to pressure, or when he's trying to run away. If it F tilt connects. I think that's the one thing I kind of want to see from Tony is a couple of change up in his formula. Like he's he does a really good job of like you know chipping away over down over time, but always always be sure to make up your opponent. Ah, oh, that. Yeah, that was <laughs> the way that Tony had kind of like moved away, the way he was moving, that pretty much allowed WebJP to just go for that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. that's so strong. Oops. I definitely want to see Tony start to slowly mix it up. Like you said, use more empty hops, change the timing. Uh, conditioning is also really important against your opponent. Yeah, but that brings the score to 1-1. One, one. People say Lucas is mid tier. I mean, compared to the rest of the cast, yeah, it might be. I think I think he's high tier. I think he's on the lower end of high tier, but I don't think he's. I don't think he's mid tier. He's definitely high tier. Moving up the highest of the high tiers, because in my opinion, there's way more high tiers in this game than there are mid tiers, and there's very little low tiers compared to. Where there was like a lot of characters who were evidently low tier and mid tier. Let's see if Tony is able to really break the mold that WebJP has been putting up. These projectiles, PK fires, PK thunders, Zares.
Nice. Oh, and he wanted to hit the connect to him so he could hit Tony for either extra damage, possibly a stock. I've, I rarely see Lucas PK through a kill unless it's directly leading off stage. Yep. Oh, that's he just got He just got pineapple. Then it was all because of PK Tony. He didn't have act. He didn't have his second jump either. So, like as soon as he got hit underneath the stage, it was it was done. But being able to fight back, Tony throwing out nares, web JP breaking combos with up air. Oh, nice! They freeze. That's good too because you want your opponent to be off the ledge from any of their options, and if you can throw anything to stop them to hold shield, especially with the way Sonic's love to go for forward smash of the ledge when it's spaced properly, that was really good for me to actually call that out. And we see a cross-up back air from Tony that's going to close out the stock. We see, like, typically we see Tony actually land that quite a bit. Uh, this is actually a bit strange that we haven't seen Cross the back air land uh, as often as we do for Tony. I think he's a little bit scared from game one, from the last game he had. Like he he went for a couple cross ups, and Wave JP just immediately punished him with dash attack. It was really really good. Yeah, good stuff. Oh, and yeah, and at that point, like Tony knows he has to go off stage. Really, oh, that was tough. I think he inter he interrupted his recovery. Yeah, he did, and it was a multi-hit too, so it really just put WebJP back into freefall. Uh, which he did opt for PK Thunder again, but by then it was too late. So, good play from Tony. But WebJP gonna close out the stock. Missing a tech, and WebJP uh, extending with the dash attack. Trying to go for a cross up, but not getting much for it with JP being very slippery. Okay, Nair into homing attack. We see Tony going off stage again, trying to catch with JP's recovery. Not, not really connecting. Spin dash is just not working. Okay, side one seems to work. Maybe uh, maybe go for that one a little more. And now we see Tony slowing it down a bit, making sure that. Whenever he does land a, a move, he's even covering land, covering his landing uh, with his aerials. But with JP able to pick up a PK fire along with a PK freeze, taking a little bit of extra damage. Oh, chasing up into the sky, but Tony does not find it. Yep, jumping in place, Tony trying to force with JP to approach. See another spin dash. This one connects correctly, and the forward air to follow up. Yeah, the multi hit connects from the spin dash, and that'll close out game three, putting Tony up 2 1. Luke is the worst online because he requires uh, precise inputs. Yeah, I believe that. Just a quick rundown, see what else is going on on the loser's side of bracket. Uh, we have Raven King currently playing Slime. H-Box is in loser's round two. Playing Oats. Oh, good. Uh, PK Beta, Super Static. And let's see. Uh, IJ. 
So it looks like oh, Raven Kings is too old and slime, so we're just dancing. Um, so yeah, it looks like Loser is running pretty well. Should be interesting once we get to that side of bracket. Okay, up till connects. Oh. Alright, WebJP doing a good job of keeping Tony at bay this time. But Tony already at 91%. Getting hit with spin dash, following with an up air. Here we go. Now it looks like that the spin dash working correctly. Whenever we, whenever we see it like working connect correctly, it's when Tony is really able to put big numbers onto WebJP. But WebJP able to pick up the stock with an F smash. That stick coming in clutch. Okay, Nair at the ledge. To get beaten out with an F tilt. Oh, that PK freeze. Whoa, he actually went for it. But, of course, the spring ride into um, directional air dodge is going to allow Sonic to recover. I feel like Sonic can recover from so low in this game thanks to being able to directional air dodge after spring ride. But still, FJP, even like with landing that back air, was able to extend his lead that much further against Tony. He's like charging up spin dash is something like we've been seeing Tony do quite a bit like Throughout, throughout every tournament, we pretty much seen him in, especially like when he jumps in the air or when he's falling. But we continue to see those spin dashes get beaten out by these projectiles that WebJP is putting out. Okay, drag down there. Yeah, having that active hitbox can make it a little bit easier to deal with spin dash. And look at that down smash at the ledge. Gonna close out another stock, covering many options from WebJP. Uh oh. Okay, getting the two frame, and now Tony the tank going in to see a spin dash, homing attack. Oh, and still able to make it back. WebJP fighting his way back onto the stage. Now down smash connecting. We're seeing a lot of action coming from these two players. Oh, okay. I actually surprised that the homing attack didn't um, didn't track WebJP. Even it looked like WebJP had the perfect spacing. He knew like where the alignment was going to come to, how the how the shot was going to angle. A okay, little bit of boxing and Tony's a tank opts to uh, retreat to the other side of the stage. Very smart. It did seem like he was coming out on the losing end of those uh, close quarter situations. Okay, F tilt connects and with JP working on his second W, the directional air dodge not going to be enough to make sure Tony makes it back to stage. We got a game five. Let's see, this is winner's finals, right? Yeah, so winner's finals. It's so winner that's going to be waiting in grand finals where... Uh... Okay, I'm back. Yep, well, we just have a game five. WebJP was able to put a lot of pressure and get some, some really good stocks off uh, Tony's the Tank. <laughs> it takes a lot for you to cheer for Lucas. Today's the day. Today's the day, friend. <laughs> Thunder. Yeah, today is one of those days. I thought I thought something went down with my Wi-Fi, but it turns out I uh, tripped on the cable, I guess. Oh. I was like, yo, there's no way. I just like upgraded the internet. I bought I bought a new router. And I was like, oh, I uh, tripped on the cable. Didn't realize it. Anyways. Yeah, let's see. Just a quick update in losers. Gaio is now fighting. Hbox, PK Beta, and Super Static are playing. Uh, I'm not too familiar with Super Static. Is what was that? Sounds like a Sonic main. Oh man, you can't. They, they all can't be Sonic mains, man. Yeah, exactly. Let's be real. Let's be real. It sounds like a Sonic main or a Pikachu <laughs> main. One of the two. Maybe both. Some people just have that strong, you know, it sounds like a Sonic name. I mean. 
<laughs> it's not my fault, man. It's not my fault. What about what about Vance? That sounds like a Sonic name. It is not. Oh uh, yeah, low key kind of. Does. <laughs> <laughs> Vance the Hedgehog. Yeah, that. Yeah, you you made Sonic. I'm not gonna lie though. I am a huge fan of the Sonic games. I'll tell you that for sure. There's no bigger fan than Master Mario, but I enjoy. Whoa, I, I, enjoy I resent game. that statement. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you can take it over him, man. I just noticed his, his you know, his, his his Twitter page is definitely a Sonic Stan account. <laughs> that dude doesn't even play Sonic. He does. Can't, you can't he have does. that title and not play Sonic. He he's told me why. It's a very good reason. I don't think it's good enough not to be the number one Stan. He's just like I love Sonic and just hate the way he plays in this game. Well. We have a very close game five so far. I mean, these two players continue to go back and forth in terms of position and damage. Right now, we see Tony extending his lead a little bit, but we know it only takes a, a couple of PK fires for that to even up. Oh, good dash attack. WebJP finds himself in the ledge. Oh, there's the PK fire. PK freeze with getting clipped by spin dash. That's gonna be big, nice. He oh, tries yeah, to intercept him eventually, yeah. A little too greedy, man. A little too greedy. Okay, there to forward air. We just continue to see the damage rack up for WebJP. Back air, good use of the double jump. Double jump will save you 1% uh, earlier from losing your stock than directional air dodge. Fun fact. Yeah. So, oh, nice. Good, good on Web JP to use the jump instead of hoping the directional air dodge would catch. Wow, he's still able to connect the forward air after? So yeah, I know. <laughs> such a hard time. Oh, that was, that was, that was really what? risky. That was really Is that it, it, Yeah. Down F2? What? Yeah. Yeah, that, I was gonna say that it was super risky because like down smash is already one thing to worry about. Down tilt is another thing to worry about, and the fact that he already like missed the the homing attack, it was pretty tough. Wow, Web JP is popping off right now. He already puts sixty eight percent on Tony's tank on his final stock down air into F smash. If that had been the other direction, this game would have been over. Yeah. Okay, back row, that's gonna close the stock. Yep. Smash you, which is something I haven't seen because the hitbox of Whip Smash is relatively big, and also Lucas gets some starting invincibility frames of it too, as well. So. I think it's just too slow, you know? We've yeah, seen it is a little too JP slow. opt to go for, for uh, S Smash instead because it comes out a little bit quicker, and, uh, you know, it's you don't really get to see that stick with the leaf too often. I appreciate that stick and leaf. Yeah, man, it, it's gone, it's been through so much. Alright, Tony looking for his... Looking for Spin Dash to connect. He continues to weave in and out of WebJP's area. Nice, I like how he's using the, the, the bounce now a little bit, trying to utilize a different tactic. Maybe too little too late, 135, I mean... Lucas got to grab an up Pomo that could be a dead Sonic. Okay, maybe it could be a grab, could be a oh, back air, what? Okay, yeah, that, that was a little too, uh, that wasn't convincing at all. But yeah, you know, even maybe at this percent back air will kill off the ground bounce. But okay, where are you going, Tony? Where are you going? In the sour spot. Oh, chasing with the yeah. PK Thunder. That's, that's going to do it. That, that, that PK fire from the outside of the stage, that's, that's pretty good. That's the most web JP way to end the game. PK fire. It's the game winner, man. The money maker, the game winner. PK fire. Oh, look. It's Wolverine. <laughs> and he too misses MSM offline. 